Why, hello there, everyone. Welcome to an episode of Crash Bandicoot 2. I'm your subtle host, Lucari Luke, and we're gonna dive into this bottle of gourmet coffee right here in this level about surfing. But where's the surfing? Also, we can totally skip that, you know, because we're just that radical. And we're gonna get more masks than you can shake, uh, whatever we shake at ma- Oh, 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 that's our first death. But you know what? We can still get the gem. And I'm gonna... Even though we didn't get that far, we still can slice a little bit of time. That timer, by the way. Uh, we're not- we're gonna ignore it for now. Basically, that other gem, if you get to the end of the level before time runs out, you get the gem. The other gem. But you still have the gem from getting all the boxes, which is the one we're gonna get right now. As for if I'm going to complete this game 100%, maybe, just maybe, for the first time ever, a world lifetime event, we're going to complete the game 100%. Basically, we're not gonna get the time, because we're getting the bonus level. Each bonus level is different, this one kinda looks like the one from the first game. And the music is kinda nice too. Ah, uh, and those boxes are no longer as annoying as before. Of course, what we could do... Ah, uh, we can slide underneath. Super extra magnificent. That's okay if we spin away some of that fruit. There's way too many fruit here. I don't even know where we can fit all the fruit. And before you say in the ass, that is enough ass jokes for one lifetime. Oh, we need the blue gem! Ah! Oh, that's right, we need to get the blue gem from the other place. Oh, I'm a freaking idiot. That's okay. That's fine. I think... Not sure. Oh, wait, unless that leads to a secret area. I actually have no idea. In fact, I might save this box collecting for next time. When we come back with the blow gem. We're not gonna get the blow gem yet. We're gonna get that another time. Freaking two parts in a row with the same level. Gosh, what do you think I am, Mario Sunshine? And of course, we're gonna be missing some boxes yet. 40. Yeah, that's what I was trying to say. Uh, that the Nitro Switch was in that secret area. That's okay, we at least got the crystal. We have not completed the lovely phallic shape, but wait, what is another message? Crystals. Wow. Not bad. Doing pretty good. I see you are getting the hang of it. I need to conserve power. I will communicate with you again after you reach the fifth crystal. Okay. He won't he won't talk to us that much. Uh the pits. Nothing to do with the arms. But he he won't talk to us a lot of times. Usually after we complete all five levels in the warp area, so not too much bothering. But we got this level, and this level is going to be a lot like the first level from the first game, and you will see why. Uh, it's got a very annoying, annoying backtrack section. It makes the other one look like freaking a walk in the park. This is not a park, this is some kind of like mushroom sanctuary for all the escaped mushrooms. The mushrooms that could not handle the power of Mario and his mustache. What am I even going on about? I've gone on full octane. This is non-stop metal mayhem. What? That's okay, we can get to this box. There's not one over there. Okay. Alright, full invincibility power. Go. Smash the person. I don't remember what path I should take first. I'm gonna go to the left. To the left, to the left. Gotta go to the left. I remember that song. They played that in elementary school one time. Don't put your volume too high or something like that. I don't know. It was it was just I don't get it. Oh oh that's right, you can't spin Oh right, okay, yes, we oh we did make it to the right path. This is the right area. Okay. I think there was a strategy to Oh right, that's right. There's one path that has the crystal and one path that does not. This one does, the other does not. I think we are approaching. Oh, jeez, that was close. We almost got our asses handed to us by a turtle. That would have been so embarrassing. Okay. Oh, jeez. So yeah, since the camera is not designed for this kind of backtracking, we gotta be really careful. And the bird has come out of nowhere. Basically, these are the, the boxes that got activated by that switch. 
pretty much. Oh, oh, you see, we died, but our death animations are not that bad. Ha, turtle, you are not smarter than me this time. Oh god, oh jeez, oh my goodness. Goodness gracious. Oh, oh, oh jeez. Oh, phew. Checkpoint. Good. Okay, good. Alright. Not bad. We have clearly traversed the puzzle of the bat. It is all we fell in the hole. The hole has encompassed us. We are now part of the hole. Damn, we got saw bladed. That is insane. Who would put saw blades on a turtle? That is ridiculous. Oh. Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, I think that's just a really an instinct that they grew saw blades. Alright, now we have gotten past to the fork. Now we're just gonna go past this way because we know this place is cleared and I just have to stroll on through and that's it. We can get to the end of the level and get that gem. That delicious, delicious gem. But there's still that turtle that we have not killed and it is on our trail. It smells bandicoot meat and it is hungry. Oh my goodness, we must run away from it as fast as we could. And those birds, the birds come back in a later game, the third game to be exact, because the other games after this aren't quite that good. Oh, oh there you go, checkpoint. Yes! Super. Alright, now we're gonna be a cheeky ass. No! We cannot be an ass. Okay, mushroom time. Now, time to go to the bonus level. Now, what is this... This slurping box here? What is, it's made out of metal. I cannot break it. It is too strong for me. I must use my entire body weight to smash it into pieces. Oh my goodness, what is this puzzle right here? We're gonna solve it right here. We just gotta slide into this twice. Amazing. This part always makes me a bit nervous. What you have to do is just simply uh, just smash these right here like that. And then what you do is uh, you go over here, you hit this block, and then you get the live. And then you just go back, and then it's like, oh. And then you just do this. And there you go, that's your lives. You can actually beat this bonus level if you just use that noggin of yours. Bandicoots happen to be. No! We have died. We have died. We won't get the gem. Actually, we can just try it again! I must have went through that bonus level like five times, it was so frustrating! Uh, but there was not much of a reaction, it was just kind of like a light sigh of disappointment when I died. So I didn't really keep it. I kept messing up on those three boxes, you had to jump in there. The striped ones. Uh, it was just awful. It was not fashion, basically. So we could just move on with our daily lives. Ah, damn it. Ah, I used to be able to do these so well, and now I have to go into the gauntlet of possums. That's okay. The possums are no match for me, and we have reached the end of the level. Yup. Alright. No problemo. Time to get our ass out of here. Ah, oh, yeah. We have 100%ed a level. For the first time, it was low horror. Aw, oh, yeah. Wapow, wapow. Okay, I can just skip this. Well, okay, I guess I can't skip this, basically. In the third game, you could. And this is the last level of the warp room. <laughs> And what the, what what is this? We can't go out here. Well, that's right. You've guessed what kind of level this is. Uh huh. It's one of these shits again. Oh man, better run. Aw oh, damn. My ass is gonna get flat. But nope, I am too speedy, and I just d right into the checkpoint. That's why you dive at the end, of and you don't want to hit those because then you're gonna die if you hit those. 
this is a lot more forgiving than the other one. It's not like two inches away from you this time, or else you don't want to like walk into those. You can spin into them, I believe. Also, you kind of jump at the end there, you can skip the kind of like the diving animation. They just did that to be a little more dramatic, that's all. But you don't need that. I don't know if you can spin. Uh, it might be, it must be like thinking of something else. Also, this thing. Yeah, that happens. Also, there's nitrous boxes. Well then. Oh shit, we fell. See, this is what happens when you try to build a snowman. It doesn't have to be a snowman. I'm good to go to a bonus level. And it's another one of these. But these aren't too bad. And there's ones with like fruit, and then there's ones where you go like this. And I'm probably gonna. Yep, I probably died. Well, th the answers that I did. I died. I didn't make it. I exploded. Would you just say, screw that tree branch and just keep going? Oh, and of course, since the boxes do count. You gotta stay and you gotta jump on these. Mm -hmm. And now I finally have run out of steam. Lovely. Just watch this bouncing. And we did it! Oh, jeez. That was slightly annoying. But it was worth it for that gem. And we got speed boosts. Oh, man. Alright, so. Ho, ho, ho. Here comes the snowman. I think you do have to actually spin that box because if you don't, there is no gem in your future. So you must spin that box. That's what we're gonna do. In fact, I'm gonna do something kinda. Ah, oh, I was trying to try to jump on you. Ah, oh, I did it! Nice! Ha! Take that. Oh, that was probably a bad idea. Oh, that was probably also a really bad idea. Oh god. Oh, oh we're gonna oh we're gonna get smushed. Oh, we're definitely gonna get smushed. Oh yeah, we're gonna get smushed. Oh yeah, that thing is gonna smush us. Also, yeah, I kinda got that. And I got no I didn't get the fuck You see that it jumps over it so that you can't get you have to get a real have to get a real head start on it. That's why those speed boosters are so so important. Damn it, I keep pushing up the timing. Ah. Ah. And the thing is, when you get electrocuted by it, it doesn't stop, it just sits there and watches. Uh. Hurry, hit those, yes! Good! Oh. Did we get all of them? Please, somebody got all of them. Yes! Oh, that was annoying. You can finally get the hell out of there. <sighs> That's right, 100% at that level. Aw, uh, yeah. Whoop pow, whoop pow, tuck tuck tuck. Alright, whew. So thank you all for watching this episode of Crush Bandicoot 2. Uh. We'll see you guys next time when we go to fight the first boss. Listen up. We are not without enemies. Some of them you may even recognize. Although they cannot harm you inside this warp room. They can attack you on your way to the next one. To get to the next warp room, use the platform that appears in the center of the room. Good luck. Good luck, and we're gonna see where we're gonna